Hey guys, welcome back to the Pink Envelope. I'm so excited to unbox my third or fourth? Hmm, I think this might be fourth Crate Chef box to you. Everything with Crate Chef, so fabulous. All of the past boxes have been unbelievably awesome. Well labeled, passing through the mail. If you looked at this, you're gonna be interested. And of course, then take a photo and or be snooping to see what your neighbor's getting. Maybe even the UPS worker is peeking over to see what that is. The perks of a well labeled box. This is their Valentine's box and it says Happy Valentine's Day. This one was curated with Chef Carl Worley and of course, Great Chef. It breaks down at the bottom and on the back, the goodies, I don't wanna see. So, I'm gonna put it aside and we're gonna dive in. Everything's always perfect, the presentation's perfect every time, it's flawless. Okay. So here is Biscuit Love. Okay, let's open this little guy. It's super cute, super cute. Savory Spice Biscuit Love Sausage Gravy Seasoning. Oh my gosh, that sounds so good. And it has the recipe on the bag. Handcrafted in Franklin, Tennessee. I have so many fabulous memories from the Franklin, Tennessee area. So, so cool. Okay. Southern Artesian Chocolate, Stone Ground in Nashville, Tennessee. It is way cute. Great presentation. Nashville's another fave. Look at all the little hearts in here, y'all. Can y'all see these? These are so stinking cute. Okay, we have Bourbon Barrel Aged red clay southern hot sauce i'm not a big hot sauce fan but my hubby is so i can guarantee you he'll be diving into that stone ground white grits mm, shrimp and grits is one of my favorite things to eat here we go there's so many things in this box it's crazy oh, look at these guys these are cute You see how they're all hooked together like measuring cups would be? I'm guessing this is your, your stamp. Very, very cool. Honestly, I don't own a full set of these now that I'm thinking about it. That is really, really cool. I think I have like one or two. Like it's like small or really big. My only two options. Okay, got scissors. As you can see, everything's packed safe. Like, you don't have to worry. This glass and it's done great. Blackberry lemon preserve. Oh my gosh. That looks so good. Now I'm craving breakfast. I'm gonna have breakfast on the brain after this. Look at this big old thing. Aretha Frankenstein, simply the best pancakes ever created. Insanely great pancake mix. Okay, the branding on this is off the hook. Super cool. Out of Chattanooga, another place that has so many amazing memories. Look at this. Voila. Muffins, pancakes. Okay. So is there anything else in here besides my recipe cards? Let's make sure. No. So I'm going to set this guy to the side so we can go through the good stuff. So here I have a recipe for family reserve biscuits. Cheese grits and chronic bacon. Chronic bacon recipe. Oh my gosh. Oh, and bacon, is this a different? Bacon jam, biscuit love chocolate gravy. OMG. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven items. Uh, well, I mean, yes, yeah, seven, but there's this is a set of five on the biscuit cutter, so that's pretty cool. As you can see, everything's multi-use. Nothing is one-time use. I mean, I guess maybe if you're really starving for a whole mess of grits, then you could bust through that. Um, this is like forever use, which is super cool. Um, they give you everything you need. So basically, you just go have fun. So guys, Mother's Day is coming up. This is a great box to get for the chef or chef wannabe in your life, where it's not stressful and she can try new things and you don't do anything, but look good. 
and call great chef. Look, get you taken care of. Tanya, this is my fourth one I've encountered for sure. I think of Unbox 3 fourth that I've had and super impressive. All of them, I'll link back to some of them so you guys can check them out. So that means you'll have to go to the vlog so you can see the past ones. Um, Chef Carl, thank you. Create Chef, thank you. This is amazing. We have so many more cool unboxings coming your way soon, so stay tuned. We'll see you guys later. Bye, y'all.